Matthew Stuckey here from Verity Baptist Church, Philippines, just giving you a quick missionary update. Uh, this past week we had a total of 206 salvations, so really good results overall. We had a midweek soul winning marathon on Thursday. There's a holiday, Muslim holiday, celebrating the end of Ramadan, and so we did all day soul winning, and we had our normal all day soul winning on Saturday. So really great results overall. Um, just quickly giving you the, the sermons I preached. Midweek, uh, Brother Chris preached for us at our uh, church in Manila. And then on Sunday, I continued the False Philosophy series preaching on hedonism, which is the pursuit of pleasure. Kind of ended Romans chapter 16, which is a warning against false brethren, people coming in teaching false doctrines. So um, the, kind of the big news, though, is that this past week, I signed a lease for a building in Pampanga. And so the church in Pampanga, when we started, we started in somebody's house. They offered to have services there. And uh, many people were very gracious when the church got off the ground with being willing to have service um, at their house and being very accommodating. And uh, we decided to switch to a building, but we were kind of renting by, on a by service basis, and um, which was a, really great for us. And uh, we'll still be there for the next couple weeks. But um, once my family moved here to Pampanga, we, we wanted to try to find an area to kind of settle down. And it's better for us to get into a lease. That way we're able to have events, um, you know, get uh, all the supplies just in one location rather than bringing them each service is a bit of an inconvenience. So we signed a lease for a building in Anjale City, which is within walking distance of us. We have a great deal and everything like that. And it's going to take us a little bit of time to get moved in because we've got to do a little bit of construction. Um, you know, we, we got a canvas for, we just bought the, the chairs just uh, literally five minutes ago. My wife told me she's actually out helping with, with a lot of these errands. And, um, you know, we've got to get an AC unit for the window and things such as that. So we're trying to get everything cleaned up and um, we're combining two places. So we're kind of dividing the middle wall so there's a bit of construction to do. We're hoping within the next several weeks, next two or three weeks, we can get moved into that new building. And I believe the area is going to be good. It's more centralized for Pampanga. And um, hopefully we'll be able to have more people that are able to come to church. And we do have a great soul winning spot really close to our church building. There is a park that um, you know has a lot of people there. Um, a lot of parks are closed down due to COVID, but it's a great park for soul winning. It's a park I actually regularly go to. And now we can invite people. And we're not asking them to go a distance, but just in close proximity to where the park is so that's really good for us we're excited about that so things are definitely busy here but things are going really well overall and so we're excited to finish the book of romans we're going to be starting first john here in a little bit but i do have some sermons uh kind of before we get into first john that we're going to go through and uh, i've kind of enjoyed the slight break from preaching five sermons a week uh, i've been preaching two sermons in manila two in pampanga getting to rest my voice but we're going to start the midweek service here in Pampanga once we are able to uh, move into that building. So here in a few weeks, um, I'm debating between a couple different books right now that we might go through. Um, to start out, what we're going to be planning to do and try this out, we're going to keep the midweek service in Manila on Wednesdays. The service in Pampanga we're going to live stream is going to be on Tuesdays. Now, we're still not going to be live streaming the Saturday service in Pampanga because I'll be preaching the same sermons on Sunday, so we'll just live stream the sermons on Sunday. But we will plan to try to start live streaming the Tuesday service. Um, you know, it, we might not do it immediately from day one. We'll try to, but um, you know, we're just trying to get everything organized and moved in and everything like that. So things are going really well overall. We're excited. Uh, once we get moved in, we can kind of just get into a more routine schedule and things won't be so uh, busy and everything like that. Right now they're pretty busy though, but hopefully we'll be able to focus more on just, you know, lots of soul winning and bringing people to church here in a little bit. But overall things are going really well, and so we appreciate all of your prayers and support for our ministry, and um, thank you, and God bless.